All right, guys, this is pretty interesting. We got a Yu-Gi-Oh monster card that has no level. This is actually quite interesting, and it is a character card. I don't know what this is. I'm excited about it. I don't know if it's going to be some new, like, uh, form of, like, you know how in Duel Links we have those effects. I'm really hyped up about this card. Uh, next up, we have a uh, few different cards for support for the Red Dragon Arch Fiend slash Synchro stuff. And this is all coming out in the Structure Deck Pulse of the King, which is actually set to release next month on June 24th for the OCG. But anyways, let's go ahead and check this out and see uh, what this is. I'm really interested in that normal monster. So <coughs> starting right off, Vision Resonator. It is a Dark Fiend Tuner effect. Uh, level 2, 400, 400. It says you can only special summon with the first effect of this card's name once per turn. And you can only use the second effect of this card's name once per turn. So the first part is if there's a level 5 or higher dark monster, you can special summon this card from your hand. Okay, that's actually going to be usable for a lot of different decks. The second part is if this card is sent to the graveyard, you get to add one spell slash trap that mentions Red Dragon Arching from your deck to your hand. Okay, this is very interesting. You could even throw this into Dark Worlds because it's just whenever it's sent to the graveyard. I don't know, maybe Dark World Synchro will become a thing. This has some potential here. Uh, next up though, we have Scar Red or Red Zone, which is a continuous trap card that says you can only use one, uh, the first and second effect of this card's name each once per turn. The first part is when your opponent activates a card or effect, if you control a Red Dragon, Archfiend, or a Synchro Monster that mentions it, you can target one card on the field and destroy it. And that's not too bad whenever they activate anything. Remember, it's a continuous. And the second part is you can target one of your banished Dark Dragon Synchro Monsters and Spar Summon up. I mean, both the effects are actually pretty viable, but uh, yeah, this being continuous just is really solid next up though okay this is what i'm really interested in what the heck is this thing so this is called mina no king or everyone's king it's a human wait is this new i've never heard is this a new type of card it doesn't even have a type so it's 3000 attack 2500 defense points what the heck it says though he was a foolish king that threw away his his hometown and friends his damage heart was saved by truly caring heart the man who has chosen to live according to his destiny will surely one day become a true king that will save the world and be beloved by all granting happiness what what if, how do you how do you summon this card though it's a it doesn't have a level so you just like normal summon here's 3000 it has no level this is weird oh no wow okay they trolled me at the very end because i was like what the heck is this thing so it can't be used in the duel but then why does it have stats i don't know it doesn't even have a level um I'm very curious, what the heck is this? Are they going to do this for every Yu-Gi-Oh card? I don't know if human is a new type, but it's listed here. This is very interesting. What do you guys make of this? I mean, because it says it can't be used in a duel, we probably can't even use it. But why are they making it having attack and defense versus just like a field center? Like, what's the point of it having stats if we can't use it and it has no level? This could like break the game in some weird, weird way. So let me know if there is a way. Like, let's say you can use it in a duel. How would you even use it? Like, I guess you could just normal summon it. Uh, 3,000, no level. Anyways, next up though, these are our reprints that are announced for the uh, Shrek Shrek. I'm actually not sure. Do we, we don't even have all the cards here. So this is just an announcement of some of the reprints. So we have Red Resonator as a reprint. We had Red Sp uh, Sprinter. We have Red Warg. We have Wandering King Wild Wind and Phantom King Hydride as a reprint. Uh, Magical King Moonsar. Uh, Red Dragon Archfiend Assault Mode getting a reprint, Assault Beast getting a reprint, Resonator Engine, Assault Mode Activate, uh, Red Dragon Archfiend Scarlet reprint, uh, Hot Red Dragon Archfiend Abyss getting a reprint, and Hot Red Dragon Archfiend Bane getting a reprint. So are any of these cards like $30, $40 cards in terms of uh, values? Let me know down below if these are any good reprints, but nonetheless, uh, I think that someone will try to make Dark World Synchros. It's going to be cool. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed the video, drop a like on it. If you're new here, hit subscribe to on that bell so you don't miss out when we cover the rest of the cards in the new structure deck pulse of the king anyways take care and i'll see you in the next video peace out